Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for July 7th of 2024 is titled Iridescent Clouds Over Sweden. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an image, Sweden in the foreground, and what we see up in the sky, not a specific astronomical event in this case, but something confined here to Earth. And that is some clouds in the sky. Now, of course, clouds are not an unusual thing. We have clouds here on Earth. We have clouds on other planets as well. So Venus is completely shrouded in clouds, as are Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. So they're all Uh, cloud covered. But what we're looking at here is a specific cloud and we're seeing what we call the iridescence of the cloud an iridescent cloud. Now this is a rare event because it requires a specific set of circumstances to to occur. And what it needs is a couple of different things. First of all, it needs the uh, stratospheric clouds and they have to be formed of water droplets that are almost exactly the same size. So if you have them all different sizes, this won't work. The patterns that we see would not occur. You also need the sun in the correct position. So the sun typically has to be hidden. If the sun is actually in the sky where you can see it, it's not going to give you this iridescence. Now, when all of these things occur and the conditions are just right, then we get the iridescence of the clouds. So these very thin clouds, what they do is they then diffract sunlight. Now, this diffraction is one of the things that can happen to uh, light. And we see it, for example, in telescopes. We'll get a diffraction pattern when we look at stars. And it's just the way the light is bent specifically there. But when you have these clouds just right, it's bent in a very coherent way. And each wavelength of light, the different colors, are diffracted by different amounts. And that therefore allows you to get this because you then see the different colors coming from slightly different positions in the sky. So that spreads them out in a way, not quite the same pattern, but in a way that you see a rainbow. Their light is scattered by water droplets and we get a combination of reflection and refraction within the water droplets that gives us the rainbow. This is a little closer to what we see sometimes with an oil slick where you'll get those very different colors uh, shimmering off of that on the ground. So here we get to see an unusual type of cloud which we call an iridescent cloud as seen over Sweden and this image was taken several years ago back in 2019. So while you can see them at any time when the conditions are right they're relatively rare because they do require those specific conditions in order to be seen. So that was our picture of the day for July 7th of 2024. It was titled Iridescent Clouds Over Sweden. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Red Planet, Blue Planet. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.